what we got here at Crouch Down, what we got here is some uh, black powder. I, uh, it took a little while to find this. It's pretty heavy, heavily regulated. I've made about uh, 10 phone calls to different people to try to track this down. You're on a few lists now. I'm sure I am. Sure I, I, knew, I knew I hit the guy who, when I called out and explained why I wanted it, I wanted to soak some liquor in it and light it on fire. <laughs> <laughs> you, get, you get a long pause. But then this guy said, do you think they use musket powder or cannon powder? <laughs> He's the guy. He's the guy. And, uh, ended up finding some musket powder. We actually decided cannon powder was probably what I wanted because we were higher on the deck, probably would have better access to that. Did you want to hand me the eye drop in front of Oh no, here, I'm sorry, they're right in front of me. Um, and uh, so we got some musket powder. You have to use this. You can't use the modern gunpowder for pellets. This has got the potassium nitrate in it. What happens is water uh, leaches the potassium right out of the potassium nitrate, renders it ineffective. So gunpowder is actually made in a slurry of alcohol. Alcohol doesn't affect gunpowder, but water does, so that's where you get that balance. What I've uh, got here, I've got an eighth of a teaspoon in each of these uh, containers here. I'm going to spread them a little further apart. <laughs> Someday get paid to play with liquor, gunpowder, and matches. I say, oh, get out of here. <laughs> but uh, no, it's, it's working out. Um, so we'll do, uh, we're going to do what I've, I've done. I've did some trials, just played around with it, but play with different uh, proofs. We've got the Plymouth uh, Naval Jam, which is this is this 57? Yes. So that should have been the standard uh, break even point. 57% British, which is 50%. Uh, you know, by, uh, by, by volume. Uh, and we've also got Lemon Art 151. And then we have the sailor's favorite, Pama liqueur, which is 27%. <laughs> which is, uh, no, this is the Pama, this is the, uh, the Lemon Art here. So you don't want to mess that up. And then I've got a control here, just to show you what happens. I'm going to tell you this test is how long these charcoal starters, I've run several of them. It tends to, to uh, Okay, here's the control with nothing in it, but you got. Oh, Opa! <laughs> you know, if you look at with a cigarette, the ATF wouldn't have you at the top of the <laughs> The black powders become really regulated since Timothy McVeigh decided to make a good detonator. And the, uh, what I've been doing is putting in uh, uh, 10 drops on this for eighth of a teaspoon to see. Like I said, it's been pretty inconsistent results, but generally it, it's been working out. So this is the palm of liqueur of 27%. Let's we'll see if we get any action out of here. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Nothing. We'll go to the... Uh, Make it walk the point. Go to the navel strength and uh, see what happens with this. this I haven't tried this before, so this could be interesting. Yeah. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten. Just want to dampen it. Ah. Ah. Somebody, some person's got to go overboard. <laughs> That's interesting. That's yeah. not going to fifty-seven percent. And we'll go last to the uh, one fifty-one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten.